Welcome everyone to another episode of the All Quarterback Fantasy Draft on Madden 23. Today's episode is massive. We're facing off against the Chargers, who are only six and ten, but the one, two, three, four, five, and six seed in the AFC, we're all twelve and four. So basically, this game determines one: we are going to be the one or six seed, but also two: are we going to win? At home, are we going to have a playoff game at home? Because the Chiefs, in our division, are also 12 and 4. They're facing off against the Raiders. We play at the same time, so when, when if we win, we could be the one seed. We win, we're the top four. We lose, we're in a wild card team. So we'll have to see all how it all goes. Here are the highlights. Chance for an early statement here on the road. Out of the gun, it's Howell. Uh, he's got it. Touchdown, Chargers. Hunter Renfro. With and those big runs between the tackles, that's a little deflating for a defense, isn't it? It really is because that's where your strength's supposed to be. Touchdown. Jeff Driscoll, 29 yards. And the Broncos are an extra point away from drawing level. As a general rule, quarterbacks don't want to lock in on a receiver before the ball is... And once more, Hal back to the air. That's caught. It's McCaffrey again. Touchdown, Chargers! Bad time for a roughing penalty, and they get the gift of a first and ten. Here's Allen. And that is caught! Touchdown, Denver! Matt Corral in the final seconds of the first half. And the Broncos have tied the ball game with a chance to take the lead into the locker room. We've been together. Completion wise, way up, not that time. Two of their three red zone trips so far, they've come up empty on. They'll look to reverse. And he is into the end zone. It was kind of stacked up, found a little bit of yardage, and frankly, they're pretty close to staying on schedule on offense. The playbook is still open for the coordinator. And this will be caught in the end zone for a Chargers. So we ended up winning the game 22-20, to meaning that we are going to be probably a one seed or two seed or three seed or four seed in the playoffs. And also, Josh Allen still played amazing, 9 for 13, 224 yards, two touchdowns. Ritter, 8 carries for 45 yards. Josh Allen, 3 carries for 22 yards. And Malik Willis, 3 for 11 and a touchdown. Tannehill, 3 for 84. Corral, 2 catches, 57 yards. Touchdown. Driscoll, 1 for 29 and a touchdown. Etling, 2 for 29 and Willis, 1 for 25. Perkins was the only one to give up a sack. 10 tackles from Trace McSorley. Which is obviously quite impressive. Geno Smith had the 1 tackle for loss. He also had the only sack. No interceptions, no forced fumbles. Felipe Franks, perfect from extra points. No injuries. And we have officially clinched the division. And that also means we are a four seed. All the teams won their games. Which is quite annoying, honestly. But, but no, we're going to be a three seed. Because the Dolphins are in the same division as the Bills. So we'll be a three seed heading into the playoffs. And of course, we have to start things off against the Chiefs, who... We have won and lost against so far this season, so it's going to be an interesting episode, next episode. Playoffs are officially starting, and obviously, we're against our division rivals, the Chiefs. I have no clue how it's going to go. We've, I mean, again, we've beat them, and we've lost to them, so I think with, with the momentum we've had these last really three, four games, I don't think anybody can stop us. Hopefully, no one can, but if you guys want more Madden content, check out the links below in the description. And I'll see you guys in the next video.